Hey everyone, it's Kelly. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my new subscribers and to part one of an amazing Michael's haul. I was on a mission to find some wish list items. I went to store number one and found half of them. Store number two found the other half. So let's jump right in. I have been looking for this paper. I found it and then I just could not bring myself to pay the $14.99 for 24 sheets. But I have been in love with this paper pack for so long. And finally, I saw it was half off. I went ahead and I jumped. I said, I'm going to get it. If it goes down lower in the future, I will buy it. And I'm going to put this away for next Halloween because I'm pretty much done with all of my Halloween crafting. This is quite possibly one of the dreamiest Halloween paper packs. It is so cute and so whimsical, so fun, has all this gold foil accents throughout. I love these little colors and just so whimsical. And I'm, I fell in love with this. I'm absolutely smitten. So look how perfect this would be for some of ephemera, some card candies, some sweet little ATCs and twinchies. Just adorable. I love the gold and the foil accents throughout these beautiful cut aparts that make some great little tags. How adorable is this? I love, love when you have like the brown and the orange and the gold during the fall with a pop of blue. Oh, just absolutely the gorgeousness. And I love this. This would have been perfect for this Halloween. But again, these just gave me some really good ideas of things to make, but it's gonna have to wait. Love this little haunted house. And then of course, these gorgeous candy corns. I'm so in love with this paper bag. All right, moving on. I did find these. These were up at the register where they have the uh, that gauntlet of all the things that we need to buy the minute we see them. But what caught my eye is these were half off. So these were 50% off, $2.49 I thought, but when I got to the register, my entire order was 15% off because of the rewards coupon. And then I had my teacher's discount, which was another 15% and the cashier stacked them both. So my entire order, I don't even know what half of the stuff was ringing up for, but I did check my receipts and the final price of these were $1.75. These are so adorable. And what I thought immediately was for shaker cards. These are going to be great to put in a little shaker, but look at this. You get the little candy corn, some ghosties, the string. If you want to make your own jewelry, you can do that. But I love the container as well. This container would be cute if you want to send friend mail and you don't want these little elements. Put those in another jar and fill it with your own little goodies. This is the first year that I started to really pay attention to how a lot of the challenges work. I'm kind of newish to YouTube as far as the Halloween and Thanksgiving crafting. When I started my channel, I took a break for about two and a half, almost three years, right when I started it because my daughter got engaged. We were planning the wedding and then uh, after the wedding, not too long after that, um, she uh, was going to have a baby. So we of course did the whole baby thing. And then when she was born, we spent a year enjoying our granddaughter. So I'm back. And so this year I'm still learning how to do some of the things. So it's been kind of like a watch and learn and see how to do things like those clipboards. Now I know for next year. <laughs> so I'll be able to keep a lot of these things and just store them away until next Halloween. So there you go, my friends. I love that. And I also picked up the ghosties and these were also a dollar 75 and i'm in love with these and if you are a friend of the pastel halloween or the pastel ween this is perfect You've got these beautiful pastel color stars all of these light colors in here these beautiful ways to say your name and then of course those amazing beads which give me a night before christmas nightmare before christmas vibes so i love both of these my friends what an amazing price wish list item number Number two, I am so excited that I found these. Oh my goodness. I'm going to start with the larger ones and then I'll show you my second wish list item. This was one of those paper pads that I went looking for and it is called Journey to the North Pole. Very whimsical, has a lot of those Kelly colors in it. These beautiful, super fun and really animated, gorgeous colors. Love, love these little cut aparts. And then over here, these amazing little candies. Some snow, I'll try to go fast. Pink, this is so cute. I already have some ideas for this one and that's why I went to the second Michaels because I was on a hunt for that holiday romance which has a pink Christmas. So there's some tags. 
let it snow and then fa la 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 with those beautiful colors and the classic peppermint stripes say freeze i did pick this one up in a mini last year during their after christmas clearance and i'm gonna try and go a little bit faster we'll be here all night this one is so sweet there's pink there's some gorgeous little cut apart some tags candy canes a cute little truck with the snowman the classic ones. Oh, this is going to be beautiful for holiday crafting. I have a lot of ideas for these big quad squares. Oh, in love. And then those mittens, super duper sweet. All right, here's wish list item number two. I didn't find it in a 12 by 12, but I scooped it up in both of the minis. This was on my wish list hunt, my friends. I went to two different Michaels and I found it at the second one and I grabbed the last two that they had. They do have one called like Christmas Romance or holiday rom um hol no i think it's christmas romance i wanted the holiday romance and this is why these colors are absolutely the dreamiest look at these beautiful tags <gasps> i have so many ideas so many ideas this one has lavender mint green that beautiful gray and of course that pop from the pink look at how gorgeous is this oh my goodness I had to find this paper. Beautiful pastel snowflakes. And right there, this one, it won me over. It did. I just had to get this. <laughs> I love, love these little tags. Some beautiful little twinchies. That would be sweet. There's those houses again. Some gorgeous deer Santas and these little postage stamps. Oh, I'm smitten, absolutely smitten. So I did pick up these two. This one is the Journey to the North Pole, this one here in the smaller form. And the reason why I picked it up is because the papers differ. So um, they're mostly the same when you get the smaller six by sixes. And then when you get the, oh, what is going on here? Okay, let me try a smaller scissor. When you get the larger paper packs, oh, I think I just ripped that, oh no. Uh, the colors are a little bit different. There we go. Oh, that's okay. I'll be able to use it. Look how cute, 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 cute. So they are a smaller version of some of the other ones, but then you get some papers that aren't in the other ones. The other one has those silver foils. This one is just little, little regular peppermints. And look at this side. Oh, so in love with this. It is so cute. And that's going to be adorable for some Christmas cards. Love these little candy stripes. So I did go ahead, and this one wasn't in the larger one, those pink snowflakes. So totally obsessed, absolutely obsessed with these two paper packs. So happy to find those. I did find the Safe Freeze, same thing again. This is the smaller one of the larger pack. And this one has those beautiful um, craft colors. And I love like a cabin Christmas and the rustic Christmas. So that was a beautiful one. And then I found Meet Me Under the Mistletoe. They had a couple of these. I only picked up one because this looks really familiar. And when I get home, I realized why. It looks very similar to one that I have from Echo Park. And still, this is absolutely gorgeous. And the colors are so robust. I love this plaid. The pops from the navy blue, just so unique. It would make a beautiful Christmas card, especially if you want to send family Christmas cards or if you want to put a masculine Christmas card together. Love, love these. Maybe one for the spouse. Isn't that beautiful? So those are the paper pads. And then same thing for these. It was buy one, get one half off. So I thought it was going to be around $7.50 because I have, you know, $4.99 and then the $2.49. But with that 30% off, it brought the price even further down. So I was super, super excited. Love, love this. The classic Santa Claus. This is what it looks like on the back. It has two of each of these ephemera and these are going to be great for putting together little packages during the holidays and for little uh, tuck spots and little tags. These are going to be so 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 cute. I love me a classic Santa so I was happy to pick that up. And then gingerbreads. This is the cutest cutest. I picked this up because I had to have that little gingerbread bakery right there. This is what it looks like. So adorable. You've got this beautiful little wreath, the little gingerbread here and here and there. And I'm so excited for this one. There's that beautiful little Christmas one with the cardinal. Back here, you've got some mittens and some beautiful little Christmas cottages in the snow. So 
So again, these came up to even less than the $7.49 buy one, get one half off. This one, which matches this one here, had to pick this up. I thought this was just gorgeous. And these are just the colors. I, I'm just smitten. And what I love about this is you can use these and pop them up on some foam. Sometimes what I do is I'll take one of these, add some of that thick Dollar Tree or other store foam behind it and just bring it up off your card. So a little tip that you can do there. Here's some more of those little stickers with the ornaments. That's going to be good for 2023 if you want to make some New Year's cards. And I love some winter critters. These are so cute with the lavender, the pink, the mint green. Oh, those snowflakes are gorgeous. And the little houses. Great for creating some ATC cards if you want to put those in with your Christmas cards. So beautiful. I absolutely love this. And this one actually reminds me a lot of... Um, Maggie Holmes. So here's, I grabbed this one here really quickly. This is the garden party that was right on the front. So if you are a Maggie Holmes um, collector and you like that, this kind of has that same little vibe. So if you see these colors here, they match very well. Here's a little card that I made for a friend and I love it. Love it, love it, love it. So that was a really big wish list item that I wanted to pick up. And then there was this one. This was the other little cute ephemera that I picked up and it is just so precious. I had to have these little peppermints, so I got this one as well. So that was Michael's haul number one. I have some more goodies to show you, and you'll see that in part two. My friends, if you like this content, please consider hitting that like button. Um, hit that subscription with your notifications on. I'll let you when I have let you know when I have a new video up. Leave me a comment. It helps me find your channel as well. And I'll see you on my next video, part two. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.